Next is Bronson Arroyo. Bronson Arroyo working out of the bullpen. You see career wise in relief 35 games with a 3.99 ERA. Johnny Damon getting his ovation as he leaves the field from center field replaced by Adam as Clippers this season at triple A as he pops it up right side. Corey into short right field and there's one down in the seventh inning. The one two is lined in the <laughs> In the right field, the one out single for Mark Bellhorn. King resemblance. Center field, highs do. And there's two down in the top half of the seventh inning. Line and out of the reach of Corey into right field. Bellhorn heading for third base as Nixon fires it back in. Crosby with a single. And it's first and third with two down. Hunter first takes off as the pitch is a strike. Second goes Crosby with two down and the defensive indifference. In the air to center field. Adam Highs do. Makes the catch. It ends the top of the seventh. Seventh inning stretch time. Ten to one. The Red Sox on top. And we'll keep it right here at Fenway Park for God Bless America on this last day of the regular season. Harry? <laughs> I didn't see that. Was that a boat then? Yes. Heisdu lifts it to deep left and off the scoreboard. Played by Lawton quickly as Heisdu heads to second base, got himself a leadoff double to begin the bottom of the seventh inning. That well, was a traumatic experience for you as yeah. Cora swings and misses. <laughs> Let's check in with Eric Freed. Eric? Tropic strikes out this time and there's two down back to back case for Felix Rodriguez. Machado strikes out as Rodriguez strikes out the side. We've played 7 10 1 Boston. Making his 17th appearance, his 13th out of the bullpen, 3 and 1 with a 3.12 coming out of the bullpen. His last outing Thursday against Toronto when he went two and two thirds in that game, only allowing two hits, no run. Swing and a miss. Papelbon going up top to get Phillips for the first out of the eighth. He bars now. Swing and a miss. Back to back strikeouts for Papelbon. Two down. Now to the plane to get all the candy bars before you get there. <laughs> <laughs> Ball four. The Felix Escalona down to first base. Well, I can guarantee you what he's going to have on the plane. Making his 10th appearance for the Red Sox. No runs allowed over his last five games, including those five innings. Last time for Del Common was Wednesday against Toronto. Pitched an inning, a walk. The center field. Nice do heading back. Adams there to make the catch to end the inning. We head to the bottom of the eight, 10 to 1 Boston. Pinning in the new pitcher, old friend Alan Embry. And you see the career with the Red Sox spanning from 2003 to 2000, excuse me, 2 to 5. He has appeared in 23 games as a Yankee with a 1 and 1. It hard, but handled at second base by Womack. He throws out Nixon for the first out here in the bottom of the eighth. This year for the Yankees against the Red Sox, you see his numbers with the Mets 213 starts for the Mets, 95 67 record. Swing and a miss, and Bear Belly strikes out two down in the eighth. Strike three call, Olerud's gone, and so are the Red Sox in order in the eighth. On to the ninth, 10 1 Boston. Sixty fifth appearance for Myers you see the numbers against left handers two twenty seven righties much better at four oh five of course Myers basically used as a specialist all season long to get those left handers out. Austin pitcher of the day. Swing and a miss and he strikes him out one down in the ninth. Season and this is when the fun begins I mean this is uh, it's going to be interesting to watch because I don't think there's a clear cut favorite. When you look at the American League in particular, I just don't see anybody who you can point to and say, okay, this team definitely is the team to beat. Uh, Loza for the Red Sox, 
And he's done a very good job at it. You see his career numbers against the New York Yankees. 81st appearance of the season for Timlin. New club record for him, too, is it's now 81. With two outs. Tony Womack, the batter. Broken bat pop up. Ramirez headed out, but that'll fall in for a hit in front of Adam Heisdu and a two out single for Tony Womack. Strike three call. The defending world champions are headed back to the postseason. Well, it came down to the last game, but the Red Sox are headed back to the postseason again.